Hey you guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to be doing a Gemini reading, okay? So we're about to see what's going on with you guys, pertaining love, okay? If you're a new person watching my channel, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Okay, so let's see. The prayer says, Lord, your heart is so loving and your faithfulness so enduring that you have invited all the nations of the earth into your family. By your greatness, forgiveness, and family is offered to all. Still you know me by name and cultivate a relationship with me. I praise you, dearest Lord. In Jesus' name, amen. So let's see what's going on for Gemini, spirit guides, of the light, and sisters and masters, my angels of light, for my collective. So we have here the sun card. You beacon it to Leo, Virgo, to us Capricorn, and we have the nine of pentacles here, okay? So I'm sitting here, some of you guys, Gemini, you have become enlightened about a situation that somebody here is not going to commit to you, okay? You could have been waiting on somebody to commit to you, like where they're not cheating, okay? You was either waiting for somebody to change their cheating ways, okay, I'm seeing here. You could have a child with this person, or you could be praying about this person right now. We have the Eight of Wands here and the Two of Wands. I'm also seeing here that some of you guys, you could be in a new connection and you feel so happy in that connection, okay? It's perfect. It's not toxic, okay? I'm also seeing here that somebody here could be stubborn, okay? But we have the Eight of Wands and the Two of Wands. So yeah, I'm seeing here that you're moving away from somebody here because this person didn't make a decision on you, okay? This person wants to keep doing other things that they felt made them happy like either talking to other people or you know having certain addictions here that was affecting your relationship with eight of wands here you guys could be a separation right now from this person but the two of wands yeah it's like this person to make a decision this person was afraid of the unknown they didn't want to make a choice here they didn't know what was next for them okay i'm also seeing here that somebody wants to reach out to you or see some type of communication here okay we have the king of wands and the star card yeah so this person okay the truth connected to this person had like a sex addiction okay this person could have been respected in the leader in the community here okay this person was very ambitious about getting money okay but with the king of wands in a relationship they are not loyal okay this person has a wandering eye okay they could be very attractive and we have the star card here yeah this person could be like in the public eye they could be a star okay when I'm sitting here, you're healing from this person, or you feel like you've healed enough from this situation with this person, okay? And we have the high priestess here. Some of you guys could be into tarot. You could look at tarot videos, or you could be a spiritualist, okay? But I'm seeing here that you're very intuitive, and you start following your intuition. Yeah, your intuition told you that this person was just, like, not going to get their shit together. We have the three pinnacles in reverse, okay? Some of you guys could have had a business with this person, but, you know, business didn't go good or go well here because i was seeing here that this king of wands could have been using you for money as well okay or like using you for your resources but yeah i'm seeing here that you start focusing on yourself somebody could have been codependent on somebody could have been codependent on this king of wands here to provide for you financially okay but it's like this person you had to listen to this person rules like you know, if you this person was going to provide for you, you had to let them go cheat and do what they wanted to do. And you was like, I'm not going to allow that. Okay, my intuition is guiding me to start something myself that I don't have to depend on nobody. Yeah, Eight of Pentacles here. You could, could have just started your own business here. Okay, or you have a new job here. But you're independent. You're feeling more independent. Okay, you're focusing on your work. Okay, right now, and we have the hangman here. Hmm. Pisces Energy. Page of Cups. Yeah, somebody here. Page of Cups. So I feel like you either went back to a situation here because this person could have apologized. But it was a fake apology because I see that this person is still doing what they're doing. Yeah. The Queen of Cups here. They could have got somebody else pregnant while they was talking to you. Okay. Clap on the hangman. The hangman. Seven of Wands. Yeah, this person is trying to keep you stuck. If you're still stuck, then that pertains to you. But if you're not stuck, this person is, was trying to keep you stuck. Yeah, it's like you put boundaries up against this person because you knew that they were trying to keep you stuck here with an apology, but you didn't go for it, okay? Because you knew it was fake. And I'm seeing here with the Queen of Cups, you're just loving on yourself more, okay? And this person could be very defensive, very angry here because they thought that they had control over you, but then come to find out they didn't. 
yeah i'm also seeing here you can have a lot of people that's trying to talk to you and this person is trying to hurry up and get you back before you talk to somebody else okay we have the three of wands here yeah i'm seeing this person is waiting on you to reach out to them okay or come in towards them some type of way like this person will believe that you're leaving them okay you could switch change the roles okay somebody here is contemplating on moving or somebody here have distance between somebody we have the ten of swords here and the ace of wands yeah somebody was dealing with a karmic a karmic cycle a painful cycle here okay somebody they could have been with the narcissist here somebody here was always making you think that you was in the wrong way that they didn't do something just manipulating you playing mind games okay mm -hmm. this person was definitely a narcissist here Somebody could have pointed the, the fingers a lot at you or tried to reverse things back on you, okay? And I'm seeing here, it's like you waited for the three of wands here to see if this relationship was going to change. But it was just like, I'm seeing somebody could have made it up through sex. Like, this person was definitely had a sex addiction. Somebody here just wanted to have sex and thought that that was going to make things up. I'm seeing here, it could have worked. But I'm seeing here, you, you caught on to what this person was doing. We had the six of wands in reverse. Yeah, you realize that this is not victorious. This is not happy. Okay, you don't want this. Okay. Mm hmm Like you felt like a failure. Or you feel like this person failed you in love. Okay. We have the five of pentacles here. Yeah. Somebody here could have caused something from this person cheating. It could have gave you some type of std here okay somebody got really sick here yeah somebody here thought that this relationship was going to be victorious and successful that sex was going to help but it, it didn't okay somebody here had abandonment issues as well with the five of pentacles here and i'm also seeing here that somebody here is going through some type of financial issues because this person could have relied on you i'm seeing here somebody relied on me with finances here but since you're leaving them yeah, it's like they don't have finances or somebody here is having temporary problems with money or how to manage it. Okay, we have the Six of Pentacles here. Yeah, this person is losing out on finances here because they keep giving, over giving to people. Okay, this person can pay other people's bills that you was connected to or, you know, just splurge their money. Illumination, the Six of Swords. Yeah, you became illuminated on that. Okay, that this person was giving to other people. Okay, mm-hmm. And then you just like the Six of Swords, you're just moving forward. Okay, you're moving on. You're healing. You overcame harsh this person with the Six of Swords. You're releasing them. Somebody here was spending money on unnecessary things here. Okay, and you looked at the, the account and you seem like, why is they spending money on this? Like, you know, Five of Cups here. Yeah, I'm seeing here that somebody is in deep regret here. Okay, they're sad, they're hurt. Somebody here could have just lost a, a, um, a loved one here. You could be sad about that and you're still trying to get over this situation with this person. Okay, and we need to have the chariot. Yeah, because I'm seeing that you move forward. Okay, you overcame any obstacles here. Okay, and I'm also seeing here somebody here is going to be so sad. They're going to be yearning for you that they're going to come show up, like pop up and try to work things out. We have the Eight of Cups and the Ace of Swords. Yeah, I'm seeing this person going to try to talk to you with the Ace of Swords here. Okay, try to see if they can work something out. Probably pull up to your house. But with the Eight of Cups here, it's like one of you, you want to walk away from this person. Like, whatever they have to say, it's like you don't want to hear it. Yeah, it's like you're still going to walk away because you just know that this person, clarify the Ace of Swords. I feel like you got all the clarity that you needed based on how this person treated you over this time that y'all was together. So it's just like whatever they have to say, it's not going to like make anything better. Seven of Pentacles, Seven of Cups. Yeah, they're going to be honest to you about where the investments went that you guys could have shared. Okay. Or if they had a job and they lied to you about being at the job, there was actually with these other options, the Seven of Cups here. They're going to be honest with you about that. And that I'm also saying they're going to be telling you that they'll walk away from these people for you. Like they're changed. But I'm saying here, you're not going to go for it. Okay. Yeah, you're going to go towards another connection with the four of wands. Here is going to be more peaceful. You're not going to have to worry about the cheating. You guys are going to work. You're going to have, you're going to get a new person. This person going to, could be on their own business. Okay. They can help you with your business ideas. And this person from the past, they're going to continue to be struggling, struggling with finances. Okay. 
So let's see, what are some sexual messages here? This person wants to tell Gemini, spirit guides, and the light, and sexual masters, my ancient prime light. So we have, just the thought of you makes me hard. We have here, I can fuck you all day. Okay, we have here, you're hurting me, so I had to hurt you back even worse. So I'm seeing here that somebody could have been dealing with somebody already. And it's like, they found that out. So they was like, okay, I need to get my, you know, my revenge. Because somebody was pissed off. Okay, we have, I love that fat pussy. Okay, we have here, careless on who I fuck. Yeah, this person had a lot of options here. Okay, that they was given to it. They was having sex with. Okay. We have here, holding my nut to please you. We have Leo. So you're being next to Leo. We have here, I feel so lucky to even have met you. I'm going to be reaching out to you very soon. I can't wait to rip your clothes off. So this person's, yeah, see, they're thinking that sex is going to fix this situation. It could have in the past. We have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, so heavy fire signs coming through. Yeah, a lot of passion. I love the sound of your moon. Okay, we have here, I ask others about you. So you guys can know the same people, okay? Hang out with the same people when they ask. We have one of one. So you're different from anybody that this person have met. We have here, you make me come so hard. We have here, gay. So somebody here likes the same sex, okay? They could be sneaky about it, okay? Or you could have found that out. Love how your pussy grips. So it's tight and right, okay? And we have squirter. So somebody here is a squirter. Okay, and at the bottom of the deck here we have, I don't think I can handle your reaction right now. So this person can't handle your reaction right now. I don't know how you're going to react. Okay, so they're waiting on you to either reach out to them. Okay, because they just know that you're just pissed off. Like, they can feel it. Okay, so I hope this video gave you guys a lot of clarity. If it did, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!